Hello and welcome to All Things Marvelous. I'm John Paul and today we're going to be making this football scene in Blender. This is a bit of a different format video. I thought I'd try a bit of a speed run for the instructions and me just talking over the top. So let me know if you like it and I can make a few more like this. So let's get into it. The first thing you're going to need is an icosphere and you want to bring the subdivisions down to one. Then we need to add a bevel and bring that down to about 0.35. Then we need to add an edge split and a subdivision surface. In the subdivision, bring it up to 2 in the viewport and then add a cast with the factor set to 1. Click on Shade Smooth. Then add a solidify, another bevel and a final subdivision surface. Play around with the bevel settings to get it looking how you want. I found using a setting of about 0.01 worked for me. Then I brought the thickness of the solidify up to about 0.12. From there we can apply everything up until the last three things, solidify, bevel and subdivision surface. Next we want to get a UV map and make a new material. Then we can jump over to Substance Painter and import our object. From there, we're going to drop on a basic underlay of the fabric material and only use the normal and roughness. I added a base color layer of white over the top and then added another layer to put on the graphics for the football. I used various logos and swooshes and a combination of the brush and projection mode to apply the details. If you want to import images as a brush, make sure it's white on black and that they're square. I then exported the material in a PSB Blender output and imported that into my object using Control, Shift and T to connect all the elements at once. I also had a bit of a play around with the displacement and just turned it down a bit. Next, I bring in a human mesh to scale the scene correctly, then bring in a stadium model that I downloaded for free from Sketchfab. I'll put a link in the description. Here I'm just making sure the scale is right and then moving the ball into position on the penalty spot. With a couple more adjustments to the size, I then move on to the grass. For this I use the Grass World plugin as it's great for quick foliage setups and uses a geometry node system in the viewport for speed and optimization. To finish up, I added some floodlights from the IES light add-on that replicates various standard photometric lighting, but you can just use normal point lights if you want. Lastly, I adjusted the camera angle for the best view and gave it a bit of depth of field by adjusting the distance and lowering the f-stop value. So there we go, a really quick football pitch scene. I hope you liked it, let me know if you would like more like this, please like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next video.